Hello again, friends. Honor delights a person. Nice to be told that we're appreciated for something special that we've done or achieved. Our desire, even as children, was that our parents or others charged with our care would love, value, and honor us for who we are. We didn't always get that. Today's good news is that God is offering that to us today. As we live in God's care, we experience the dignity and honor he always meant for us to know. Both riches and honor come from you and you reign over all. In your hand is power and might. In your hand it is to make great and to give strength to all. Only when we see ourselves as God sees us can we truly know self-respect and value. God created us in his own image and he is the amazing creator of this universe we dwell in. Jesus demonstrated our significance in God's sight by giving up his life on the cross so that we could be reconciled to God and live with him forever. The Bible tells us that we are precious in God's sight. You made them, humans, a little lower than the angels. You crowned them with glory and honor. But we do see Jesus, who for a little while was made lower than the angels, so that through God's grace he should die for everyone. We see him now, crowned with glory and honor because of the death he suffered. God says, you're precious to me. You're honored and I love you. Well, Heavenly Father, we know that it's time to live as honorable people. We acknowledge that we're created in your image and made new from anything that's gone wrong when we joined our lives with yours by trusting in the death and resurrection of Jesus for our forgiveness and healing. Thank you for new strength and a conscious sense of our dignity in your sight as we follow your principles. Today, we confidently enter into the life of love, honor, purpose, and peace you've prepared for us. This is life at its best. We know you will honor us as we honor you by simply obeying your commandments. Help us to do that today. Amen. Let's live as honorable people today. Have a great day.